All right, guys, just to recap, I am at a uh, salvage yard, junkyard, whatever you want to call it. So anyways, the uh, purpose here is to show you how to remove the glass once you've removed the door panels, which I put in my other video, how to remove the uh, window motor, which I also put on another video. I like to keep these short, but anyways, here I go. So what you're going to need for this one here is a 10 millimeter to loosen up this um, window here or the track. You will need a Phillips. And on some of these, I already pre-loosened them just to keep the video short or just for uh, keeping the video short uh, purposes. I don't edit none of my videos so far right now. Uh, I hope to, in the future, if I can get uh, more of you guys to subscribe and uh, start watching. Again, Phillips right here, it's four of them. And I would actually suggest that you uh, disconnect the speaker first by pushing that there and then here. Uh, let's see if uh, the speaker falls off, then there'll be a blooper. All right, and just pull on this. This one has probably never been taken off, so it's still stuck on there. Lay that somewhere where it won't get damaged. The purpose of removing the speaker is so that you have access to the glass here. You can hold it. Um, of course, I'm going to wedge this glass. And uh, it has a Phillips screw here. There's a rubber boot that goes there. This one doesn't have a rubber boot. Obviously, it's probably had this window replaced already. Very common on these Kias to get stolen and this rear glass to get uh, smashed in. Um, that one's going to stay in there, but you can remove it later using a magnet. So that's basically it on this one. You're going to now take that 10 millimeter, loosen this one up. Okay, this one here is probably going to fall in there too. Again, you can use a magnet. Now, you're going to want to pry up on this one here. And remember, we took off that screw there. So now what we're going to do is pry up on this one here. Again, lay them to the side. This glass is already loose. I'm gonna pull up on it. And it's actually loose here. Let's see, hopefully my video doesn't turn into a blooper if I break it. There you go. That's what you wanna hear. Then you move this one to the side a little bit. You turn this glass over. And that's use both hands here. So you turn it over to the side, like so. And this glass is tempered, so don't worry about breaking it. They don't break that easy. And then uh, basically you just pull up on it. And there you go. So this one here was obviously in a car fire. That's why that color, brownish color is on there. And again, it was another victim of theft. And again, it was a fire. So I'm going to go ahead and clean that glass and uh, see what happens. But yeah, that's the gist of it. And uh, same thing to put it back on. I'll see if I can make a video of that later. Thank you, guys.